I will give you 10 project ideas to become a world class programmer. But before getting into the detail of this project, please write some nice comment below. And my grandma told me if I get 100 comments in this video, she will give me a cookie. So please comment some nice things under this video and so that I can get a nice cookie from my grandma. So the first project idea we have is like unit converter. Unit converter is very simple and doesn't matter whether you are learning Python, JavaScript, Java or even you are building Android app, you can easily build an unit converter. This unit converter by or unit conversion is something like you are taking a unit, for example, you are taking kilometers like 10 kilometers and you are trying to calculate how many miles out of it or you are taking some kilogram and you are converting it to a pound. That means you are converting some unit. It could be a length, it could be a weight, or even it could be a temperature. So you're taking temperature in degree Celsius, you are converting into a Fahrenheit. And by doing this project, you would be learning how to take an input from a user and then add some simple multiplication and then show that output. If you do really good at in this conversion, maybe you can change your luck or your life. For example, you are a lonely single dude and you are really good at conversion. So you can convert yourself from a single person to a someone in a relationship. So this is your first project idea. The second project idea is a stopwatch. It's very simple one. You will have one single button that will start and then it will start counting seconds or milliseconds and then it will continue. And by doing this project, you will learn how to deal with time. That means every programming language has like a time stamp and you can use like a date time object and you calculate and you continuously update the display based on this. And this is a very good learning before going to a bigger one. And after that, you can make a little bit extension of this project of stopwatch to a digital clock. Or if you are even better, you can create an analog clock that will have like three arms. And if you do these projects, you will learn how to deal with the projects, how to control time and display outputs. So this is your project number two. And project number three is very simple to build a calculator. First, start with a simple calculator. That means you are taking an input of one or two numbers and then add this together to display the output. And you can extend it to a like in from addition to subtraction, multiplication, divide, percentage or a modulus and all these things. And if you want to expand it, you can convert your normal or regular calculator to a scientific calculator. In that case, you will have some assign function and few other scientific notation that you can use in your calculator. And this calculator will give you like handling with like a multiple types of operations and with like similar input. And if you want to do it and you would be able to organize your project because as you are growing with the projects, you are doing new, new stuff and your project is growing little bit. The project number four is your uh, personal assistance or your to-do list or your reminder app. And in this way, what you will do, you will have an input box and you will insert some task. And after that, you have to do few more functionalities. For example, you can mark some tasks to be done. That means these are your done column and you will know how to filter some of the object or the task because every task will have multiple properties. So try to do it in an object oriented programming way. In this way, you'd be able to learn about object oriented programming as well. You will have the task, you will have the task status, whether this is a done or not done. Even you can have a like a task deadline. That means like this task is due on that particular day. And after that, you will do some kind of reminder. That means you can check with like some kind of notification. And if you are doing a web development, definitely you can set a like an alert. If you're doing an Android, in that case, you will give some a push notification or maybe some kind of toast at the bottom. And this way you would be doing some uh, to-do list, but you can name it in a fancy way that a personalized reminder or my personal assistant. And if you put it on your resume, it will look very fancier. So that is our number four project idea. And number five project idea is simple game. And in simple game, you can start with like a 
tic tac toe and if you don't know about what is tic tac toe you can tickle yourself but don't tickle your grandma because she will be really angry on you rather just google it what is tic tac toe is some kind of game but this give you some kind of like a multiplayer vision that okay you are storing some values and you is you are getting some other values you are comparing these two and then see whether this is something together you can use for some purpose so this is uh, number five ideas but if you want to know a little bit more into interesting game in that case you can check out this youtube channel and you will find that we have a game called chicken escape and in chicken escape what we are doing that some chicken is falling from the sky and you try to avoid from the sky because if the chicken hits you in that case you would be kind of like a your head would be damaged or something will happen so check out that game and uh, if you are familiar with python or javascript or even java you can build that game and you can show this game to your friend and that would be a great show off for you and there are few other game you can build like a simple racing game or you can do a, like a space shooting game that you can find in our uh, android app or the iphone app so if you are not familiar with the programming hero mobile app definitely you can go to the google play store or iphone app store and search for programming hero and you will see that we build a space shooting game and inside the app itself in the one of our module our galaxy shows you a step by step process to build that game and try to build that game yourself and then build some other game and that will give you a very good projects and even you can show this to your friend or your potential one to impress that person that you can build a game and if you want to build that game for your special one definitely put their name inside the game to make them even more impressed about you number six project idea is to give daily course and daily course give you an interesting aspects of programming that means you are accessing some apis if you search for like any course api online you will get a lot of places where you can just randomly get course and your software or your application will have a certain scheduled work that means every day eight in the morning or every day in the midnight or even in the afternoon at the 2 pm of the person using your software will get a random course and this gives you the knowledge about how to use an api how to have a scheduled task from your programming and then it will fetch something from the api and display it as an output so this would be a very nice angle to work on it and next number seven project idea is an weather app and you can just go to like access some weather api and know and you provide current zip code or the location latitude and longitude of the user and it will tell you what is the temperature right now what is the chance of rain and uh, maybe there will be wind or or no wind or it's snowing or not all this information and if you want to like go a little bit beyond you can build a voice command around it and if you have the voice command in that case you will say something like okay what's the temperature or even you can make it smarter and then i'm going outside and it will know what's weather outside and you will know if it is raining it said okay take the umbrella with you or if it is cold it's like okay don't forget to wear the jacket that means you are putting some kind of intelligence into it and that's a great showcase for your project too number eight project idea is a news aggregator so what is news aggregator you will see a lot of news sites and they are pushing news every single hour and you might have particular interest but you don't have interest everything in the world in that case what you can do you can do something called web crawler if you're using the python or few other programming language you will get libraries to crawl internet and find news and you aggregate those and every news has some title and you will check for some particular keyword for example you are kind of filtering news about covid that means if any of the title has like a covid or virus or maybe epidemic or something in the title then you will filter those and serve those news and this is a nice way to crawling internet maybe storing the data in your database and presenting some filtered results so this would be a great project for you and number nine project idea is a chat app and chat app will tell you that some way you can 
interact with like a real time interactions. That means somebody sending a message and you want to work with like a input and output at the real time. That means you are sending a message like a Google Messenger or WhatsApp or Instagram message or some other way. You can easily use those to interact with people and you will know who is messaging home and to pop up this message and build those interactions this is would be a nice nice project for your profile and it will give you like a wide breadth of knowledge and number 10 project idea is your uh, e-commerce website so you can build an e-commerce website uh, that will have a lot of products and there would be like a shopping cart and there would be some way you in integrate the payment options so you can use like a stripe or uh, paypal or some other payment gateway and you will have database catalog products people would be able to filter and your website would be something similar to amazon or ebay and this will give you like a full stack experience for your project uh, implementation and you after doing all this ten, you can consider yourself as a junior programmer or junior developer so these are the 10 exciting project ideas that you can start as a new programmer and comment below that out of this 10 how many you already have implemented and also don't forget to write some nice comment for my grandma because if there is at least 100 comment below i will get a nice cookie from her that's all from this video. Don't forget to check out Programming Hero app from the Android and iOS app store. I will see you in the next video. Take care.